All right, everyone. So for the month of September, my videos are going to be all about the respiratory system. And if you're watching one of my videos for the very first time, my name is Adrian, and I love to empower moms to reject the status quo and embrace healthier lifestyle habits. So I don't know if you've ever seen a picture of the lungs compared to trees, but it's pretty amazing the similarities and just the whole relationship that we have with plants we are breathing in and out opposite things so we complement each other very well it's part all part of God's beautiful design it's very fascinating so this video I'm just going to talk about some of the basics of the respiratory system and give you some um, other little bits of information that I found along my years of research so the respiratory system is super important to your body just like all of our systems it helps to make breathing possible helps to filter waste in the form of gas out of our bodies um, without a properly working respiratory system, your cells can't get enough oxygen and that's a huge problem. So you wanna make sure you're taking care of your respiratory system, if at all possible, doing everything that you can to help it along its way. So the parts of the respiratory system are your nasal cavity, your pharynx, or your throat, uh, and it helps to connect your nose and your mouth to your esophagus. So like this back part of your throat back here, like when you're swallowing. That's where um, your pharynx is. Um, it's also where lots of illnesses happen, like cold and strep throat. It's in the, that back part of your throat. Your larynx is also called your voice box, and this is what helps us to swallow. It contains our voice, our vocal cords, so our voice box um, is how it got that name. Then also your trachea, which is also called your air pipe. Um, it's just the tube that goes from your mouth to your lungs. Then your lungs, bronchi, and diaphragm are all considered part of your respiratory system. Um, I'm just going to talk about a few things uh, that I have found, discovered, enjoy talking about um, in regards to the respiratory system. So chakras are energy points along your body and keeping those energy points in balance is a great way to maintain wellness within your body so your chakras that are associated with your respiratory system are your heart one which is about right here and it's its color is green usually and it stands for balance and love and then your throat chakra which is like right here is often colored blue and that is for expansion and healing just little fun facts the meridians are also points of energy systems within our body. They're kind of like uh, energy pathways and channels uh, that span all across our body, different parts, glands, and organs. And a way to balance your meridians that's super easy is to take one hand and your other hand and you just hold each digit. You can kind of feel it like pulse a little bit and when you can stop feeling it to pulsing. You to do each of those and then you switch and do the same thing to the opposite and that just helps to balance the meridians in your body. If you want more information, um, you can just type meridians in the comments and I can send you more info. It's just, it's just basically about energy and keeping everything flowing. Your teeth also have a connection to the respiratory system. Um, it's your last tooth back here before your molars. They're called your premolars, and they're on the top part on both sides. That's um, actually connected to your lungs. So if you go to the dentist and you're having issues with those specific teeth, maybe you have cavities, maybe you're having some other issues, it could be um, connected to your lung. A lot of times we think of illness as an isolated event, and oftentimes it's really your your body sending all kinds of warning signals and we're just not picking up on them. Unfortunately, a lot of doctors aren't trained that way. So if you don't do your own research, you might not know that. Um, the last thing I wanna talk about with the respiratory system is that you have VitaFlex points on the bottoms of your feet. So on the bottom of your foot, just below the ball of your foot is where you would rub for your lungs to help stimulate. We love essential oils, so we will put essential oils on the bottom of our feet and sometimes massage in that very specific area, whatever the need is. So I hope that gave you some value. I hope you could hear me over all these noises outside and I hope you have a great day.